So what's on my mind today? I don't know. Um, I have been thinking about a lot of things yesterday. Um, so something, you know, kept coming into my head, which is um, that, you know, R. Kelly's partner, um, when she was facing the abuse that, the, that R. Kelly was giving, um, you know, she, she often would cry or pray to God and be like, God, why are you letting this happen? Why aren't you stopping this? Why aren't you, you know? And the interview was bad, you know. She 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 obviously experienced a lot, but I'm kind of as as a god, this is something that a lot of people do. A lot of people do this, you know. They go through trauma, and and then they turn to God and think, why did you let this happen? And and then I think the truth is, it's just like God's like a ghost, you know. I, I, couldn't she see that maybe this is happening because you're in a relationship, you have not chosen to leave, you have chosen to stay, and things are getting worse, you know? If, if things are getting worse, things are, things are different, difficult, you know? Because if you, if you have kids with someone, if you're, you know, a, a lot of women face um, sexual or abuse, um, wife beater or whatever, you know, um, um, domestic abuse, I think it's called. Um, you know, a lot of people face this, and, it, and it's it's not a simple case of, you know, should, well, it is a simple case of should I stay or should I go? Um, and, and everything is like positives and negatives. So the positives of staying is that, you know, you've got a good career, you've got a father figure, you know, are things really that bad? Can, how much can you tolerate? And, and then things probably get worse and, and you leave and stuff. And yeah, I think the thing that bothers me is that so many people would, you know, expect God to do things for them. And it's just, it's just not how, how it is. You know, God, if, if you have a fish tank full of guppies that are all raping each other every single second of the day, or, you know, or if, say if you have two male fish that are attacking each other and, and one even dies, you know, I mean, that male fish could be sitting in the fish tank going, why is my owner not helping me? Is my owner not real? Why Why is the person that gives us the food? Why is, you know, why are they not doing anything? And at the end of the day, you can't just stand and, and look uh, look over them and, and, you know, separate them every time they, they fight or or stop them from, just, you, you can't, you can't do it. And I, I just wish people, I wish I could talk to people and, and tell them, that god is like an owner who has a fish tank and if you're if you've got eight billion fish in your fish tank you know you you can't control things you know i, I can inspire and okay maybe if someone got run over by a bus maybe i could have inspired them not to walk out in front of that road but if they can't hear me then could i have even done that you know that that's the sort of situation that i'm in and if they're the sort of person who would get run over and then kind of spend the rest of life saying i hate god i hate god 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 you know didn't help me god did nothing you don't really know the situation you know because maybe maybe there were other times where you almost got run over and maybe something inside of you was able to to tell you not to i mean i'm sure loads of people have had near you know near car accidents and and you know they thank god at the time and then a few days later they've forgotten about it now if something would have happened, you know, they could spend their whole life in, in paralyzed or whatever, and and things would have been very different. And it's it's interesting. It's, it's it's kind of horrible to know that you know if if I have been if I did stop people from being run over, I could do that a billion times, and there will still be people getting run over, and there'll be still people hating god for for letting them get run over and it's just like yeah well you you don't know what's god's done and what's god's not done and i don't know and and i'm and i i just yeah i'm just thinking i'm just thinking about this i'm thinking about my next step um my next step is i, I want to finish i need to finish off these <coughs> cards these name cards that i'm doing with the females and I want to go on to the guys but I, I keep wanting to start on the guys first because I really want to, to do a card for God the Father 
and then just write up all the Christian names, you know, God of the Christians, um, and all the positive names, and then the, the, the negative names, you know, God of lies, and, and the gods a man wants, and, and I just want to, I, I kind of really want to do that card. And then I'm thinking also about, actually, I probably should do a card for my higher self, God the mother, um, you know, um, and I, I could say it's the God that no one wants, but I, I don't know if that's actually the truth, because I think people do want, you know, they, they want something to come and, and, and reduce the population or, or some, something to come and make big changes. I think a lot of people want that. They will want to be on the right side, of course, but part of being on the right side is, is being able to <coughs> connect with the spirit and feel the spirit got a negative one for up for Allah I guess the positive name will be God of nature and and animals you know I do feel like I am I, I am Allah you know I, I do feel like that but not as a human I, I feel like Allah represents nature and wildlife and animals and before humans existed you know lions tigers and and interesting creatures you know they, they all were formed and and that's who i would associate allah with being you know i i feel like they do have a connection with allah but they don't have a connection with me um but but they have a connection with nature and you know i think there's there's quite harsh natures in there you know the black and white thing well same with hamsters, you know, you get black and white hamsters, you know, and, and separation and treating females and males differently. You know, nature treats a lot of things in in the Quran or in their, not in the Quran, actually, in, in the, just in the general Islamic belief, you know, it's it's all nature, nature based. And it's, it's like it's going back to the core roots of, of what life was like before humans were here. That's that's how I would describe Allah. And, you know, I was here before humans. I, I was the God before humans. So I would say that I am Allah, but not me. Not me. This, this I'm the human, more evolved version. And, and yeah, if people call Allah, Allah, God Allah, I feel like they have no connection with me. But that doesn't mean that they don't have a connection with, like, the old me. The old me before humans. The, the old me that created animals and wildlife and nature. You know, I didn't actually create it. Well, I kind of did. I mean, lizards would have taken over if it weren't for me. So I didn't create lizards. I, I um I made sure that they weren't getting too big by helping create other things through evolution, of course, not just by pinging pinging animals on Earth. Um, but yeah, um, I'm very depressed, and I I keep thinking about what could happen, like. How are people going to actually talk to me? Are they waiting for me to come to them? If they're waiting for me to come to them, why aren't they telling me where to go? Why aren't they telling me who I have to, to know or be with? And I, I I don't know who knows, you know. I, I would have assumed that Madonna definitely does know. Um, or maybe she doesn't. Maybe she does generally care about all the, the people dying of AIDS. Um, and, and generally does think that her daughter's songs are nice when I'm just like, yeah, they're horrible. They're absolutely horrible. Um, I, I just don't know. If, if you don't know someone, then you don't know the answers. And I'm going away next week to Butlins. So that might cheer me up. Um, but yeah, got quite a lot of name cards to do still though. Got all the males and still some more females. And then I've got the bands. But, um, I am, um, I'm, I'm very, very depressed. Um, and I, I, I feel like it's going to be this way until people start talking to me. So I just, I really hope that people start talking to me soon. <laughs>